guys, it's Kylie, and in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing my 2021 goals and recapping 2020. So to start off for 2021, I thought it would be a fun video to share all the goals I have for this upcoming year and kind of recapping what happened on my channels in the last year. I will be going through both my Disney channel and I do have another channel that I'm going to be sharing a little bit of information about in this video as well. But if you guys are interested in Disney videos, definitely subscribe button, turn the bell so you get notified every time I upload. I post tons of Disney content on this channel and I'm going to go through all the fun videos that we did in the past year and, and the goals that we had set for 2020. And how we did on reaching those and some goals to look forward to for 2021. So I wanted to start off with my goals for 2020. Um, I started off with a subscriber goal of 700 and we were able to reach that. I am filming this on New Year's Eve in the afternoon and so this is about 24 hours before I post this video and I had a goal of 700 and we are currently at 710 subscribers so we were able to reach that and I did have one other small goal of posting at least one video a week and reach that definitely in a a lot of weeks we hit actually multiple videos but we at least posted one video every single week which was awesome i did also start a second channel in 2020 this is a channel called manager kylie and it is a sports-based channel it's all about sports administration coaching all about sports and in this channel i started off just to see how it did and it did pretty well uh it's currently at 55 subscribers and is growing it has some good views definitely uh, some of my videos have done much better than a lot of videos on this channel and the, hitting the algorithm and just being being informative it's a lot more informational versus this channel I share a lot more of the different Disney vlogs and hauls and all that that channel is much more informational but if you're interested in anything like that definitely check that channel out as well and I will say I'm gonna go into this a little bit more later in this video but December was definitely my best month by far for my channel so far which is awesome my channel continues to grow and I did have a great month in December so kind of the goals and plans I have for this channel and my other channel for 2021 the first goal is subscribers wise my hope is by the end of April beginning of May to reach a thousand subscribers just because that's the big milestone on YouTube I'm not gonna set a subscriber amount for the whole year I just want to see where this channel goes and really work at growing it but my goal is to reach that thousand subscriber March by the end of April beginning of May mathematically putting in formulas and stuff that's about when I should reach it so my hope is to continue to grow if I reach that even earlier that is awesome um, and that's specific for this channel my other channel my hope is to be at about 100 to 150 by the one year mark of that channel. I started my sports channel on July 1st. So my hope is by July 1st of 2021, then about, about 100 to 150 subscribers. Obviously, if I'm above that, that's great. But I've seen great, good growth in that channel, and I think that's definitely doable. I got about 50 subscribers in the first six months. My hope is to get at least another 50 in the second six months. So for my posting schedule this year, um, my posting schedule will be influenced a little bit by swaps and different collabs I have. I have certain collabs that are on certain days of the week. I have certain collabs that are certain days of the month. So it definitely will change month to month. But generally, you're going to see a video from me every Sunday, every Tuesday, and every Friday. Those are going to be my three posting days. There will be some weeks that you actually see more videos there'll be some weeks that I might post Monday Wednesday Friday depending on when these swaps and collabs are I don't have a ton in January but I do have two swaps slash collabs that are once every single month so definitely be on the lookout for those so that's two videos every month that you can be on the lookout for and then there is a few months that I have a bunch of swaps planned so definitely be ready to check out all, all of those um, my goal is to at least try to post on that Sunday Tuesday Friday schedule I might even use these swaps and collabs as bonus content so I will still post my regular Sunday Tuesday and Friday along with maybe adding in a Monday a Wednesday or Saturday just because of how those swaps happen to fall they're not on a specific day of my posting schedule so you will also see those as well and they might influence my schedule a little bit I do also post every single Wednesday on my sports channel so if you're interested in more content from me on Wednesdays that is where I am posting every single Wednesday that is just that I post once a week on that channel nice and easy every single Wednesday all my videos that are not swap or collab related will be posted at 2 p.m. Eastern time on both of my channels the collabs and swaps generally are posted in the morning between 9 and 10 a.m. It's just when other people like to upload and it's up to the person in charge of the swap to pick that time so I those are usually posted early in the day but the rest of my videos will be posted at 2 p.m. Eastern time now on the content that I'm gonna put on my channel I will have my continued swaps collabs 
year making videos, pin videos, the basic videos that I have. I do also have some Disney trips planned and I do have one coming up very soon that I will be posting vlogs and different content from. I'm definitely looking forward to going back to the parks to be able to make some more content. So that will definitely be on this channel. I am also gonna be doing a lot of shorts. So on the days I'm not posting a regular video, definitely be a lookout for shorts for me. They will not be posted at a specific time. It's kind of just when they are available and when I make them. But the shorts, I will say, have kind of blown up and people have started to post them and they have caused a lot of traction to channels. I posted a couple shorts as a test on the 26th of December and yesterday, which was the 30th for me, my channel hit about 1500 views in one day. That is the most I hit in by a landslide in any day. That's some, some of my months are only like about double that. So I usually get about 3000 views a month to hit 1500 views in one day was crazy. And the day before that, on the 29th, my channel hit about 500 views, which was my most views for a single day before yesterday where I hit the 1500. So that's just ridiculous. The first day was really one of my shorts that kind of picked up and got to that 500 views, plus a couple views by regular. I usually average between 50 and 200 views in a single day. So adding that to my regular videos that were getting traction, that was kind of like insane to get up there. And then yesterday, on the 30th when I saw the traction that a couple of my shorts were getting, a few of them were getting a bunch of things. I had one hour that had about 300 views. And like, for me, I like almost passed out. That was crazy. Usually that's what I get in a day. So to get that in a single hour was ridiculous. So I'm definitely gonna be doing a lot more shorts. So definitely be on the lookout for those. It just seems like a great way to grow this channel. And it adds something quick. It's more like a TikTok style, nice and quick vertical video. You can find them both. They'll be posted on your subscription feed, but along with, there is a shorts area on YouTube on mobile that you can look at shorts but i definitely will be posting a bunch more of those so be on the lookout for those as well just sprinkled in on the days i'm not posting regular content i will be posting those shorts too i will be doing all the disney ones obviously on this channel but i will also have some sports and educational ones on my other channel now for some of the other platforms i use i do also use instagram for both of my channels. I am more active on my Disney Instagram. I will definitely be posting again on that, posting Instagram stories, posting just photos and everything on that. So definitely be on the lookout for that. I love using my Instagram. It's a great way I find to connect with other people in the Disney YouTube community. I will be doing pin trades through Facebook. I will do wishable trades, all of that. So definitely be on the lookout for that. I always have my Instagram if you're interested in that. So I will be continuing to post on my Instagrams. I also am gonna be posting all the shorts that I make for YouTube. I will also be throwing those on TikTok. So if you're interested, I do have a TikTok talk as well you can be check that out just another platform to be posting it's kind of working all these platforms together to grow as a whole unit i know i have two different sides of me i have the disney side and the sports side but together we're going to work them all together i have platforms for both the tiktok is kind of a mashup of everything but i do love using both youtube and instagram to connect with everybody and connect with everybody in this community so for 2021 i'm just looking forward to continuing growth on this channel and continuing to connect with everybody in the community i'm looking forward to a great year hopefully with some awesome Disney trips. And if there's anything you're interested in seeing on this channel in the new year, definitely let me know in the comments down below. I'd be happy to show you anything that you're interested in. So definitely let me know. And I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. And I really am thankful for everything that has happened on this channel in 2020. And I'm looking forward to this great new year of 2021. And I did say in my original Vlogmas giveaway that I'll be announcing the winner of my Vlogmas giveaway today. So I will be doing that right now. So if you entered my Vlogmas Miss giveaway I'm gonna be picking our winner right now so pulled up on my computer screen that you can see I have a tab that is my vlogmas giveaway this is everybody that has entered the giveaway and some people did win more than one entry I had two people that watched every single one of my videos so thank you to Dollar Tree Crazy and Darla Parsons for watching every single one of my videos and answering the question of the day on every single one of those so they got four entries and then I have a bunch of other people that entered we had total I randomized all the different names that had entered and we have 20 different entries so you can find your name in 1 through 20. I kept track of every single comment that I received and everything to make sure that everybody was marked down. I had all the different comments, both of the ones that answered the question of the day and other comments that I received just to make sure that I was tracking, to make sure that everybody that answered the question of the day got entered in a video. That was really the one requirement. It wasn't just make any comment yet to answer the question of the day. So we had 20 different total entries in the giveaway. We're going to head over to random.org and we're going to go to that page. We're going to refresh it three times. So there's one, uh, there's two and there's 
three and we are going to type in the number 20 because that's how many people entered our giveaway and we are going to generate and number eight is our winner and number eight is Kaylee Hopkins so I'm gonna reach out to you Kaylee on Instagram to let you know that you win congratulations to everybody that entered Thank you for all the support and this channel throughout December and I'm looking forward to an awesome 2021. Again, if you have anything you want to see on this channel in 2021, definitely let me know in the comments down below. I'd be happy to add that in for videos for you. I got lots of content planned, but I'm happy to throw in anything you're interested in. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching today. I'm looking forward to 2021. I'm looking forward to the continued growth on this channel. Thank you for all your support and I'll see you guys later.